Oh, hi, what's up? <laughs> it's your girl G Baby. <laughs> hey there, I'm Gianna, and I'm going to be talking about coconut oil today. Oh, hey there, my name is Gianna Dinato, and I'm going to show you something I like to use called coconut oil. <laughs> Today I'm showing you just some skincare and beauty uses of coconut oil. Coconut oil. I'm getting a little nutty up in here. One of the first things you can do with coconut oil is use it as a cheekbone highlighter. So I know all of you girls out there buy these fancy highlighters and stuff and that's all great. But if you want just a little bit of oil, Next up is makeup remover. I remove my makeup every single night with coconut oil. Take a little bit of coconut oil on your fingers and remove that mascara and everything. And wash your face off in the sink. Um, and then use your face wash after. Just take a little bit on your lips. And it's a nice little shine. Um, I I've bought so many expensive night creams, it's ridiculous. And I've always had a problem breaking out. I started just using coconut oil after I washed my face at night, and I noticed such an improvement in my skin. I was like, why am I buying these $97 night creams when I can just put a little bit of coconut oil that's like $8 at the store, and my face looks 10 times better. I also, before I go to bed, put a tiny bit of coconut oil on my finger. And I just brush my lashes like that, and it conditions them every single night. It's so good for them. It's a great hair conditioning treatment. I was actually on set recently, and I didn't wash my hair one day, and the hairstylist was like, all right, we're going to work with this. And then the next day, I had put a little bit of coconut oil in before my shower, and kind of let it sit in there for a second, and I washed it out. And the next day, she totally noticed a difference. She was like, did you do something? Like it just feels, the health of it just feels so much better. It's coconut oil. Coconut oil on your face before bed. You swipe those lashes with it. And then you put it all up in your hair. And just sleep with your coconut oil all over. And then you wake up and shower it out of your hair. And you'll just feel so refreshed and good. And it's worth a try. Even just one night. Two tablespoons per day is supposed to really rev up your metabolism. So if you're interested in that, it's something that's really good for you internally as well. This is something that is kind of disgusting sometimes, but I used to do it like last year all the time, and it's called oil pooling. You always just put like a tablespoon of um, oil in your mouth, and you just swish it around for a good like, honestly 15-20 minutes if you can. And it's just supposed to be really good for your teeth and for your mouth and it's supposed to like pull out toxins from your body and then you spit them out. <laughs> for all you mothers out there, um, it is a very good diaper rash cream. Um, instead of using some other baby creams for their booty when they're irritated, just use a little bit of coconut oil and it will totally improve their skin's health and it's very natural and healthy for your kid. It's also a very good stretch mark preventer. Um, while you're pregnant, um, it just helps really moisturize and it's something that you can put on your belly every single night. It's a great um, nipple cream for breastfeeding, so I don't need that, but um, I know all of you breastfeeding mothers out there probably are dying for a healthier nipple cream, and that is coconut oil. Alright guys, so that's all I have to share with you today about coconut oil. Um, there are so many more uses for it. This was just some skincare and beauty but um, I'll do another post about coconut oil soon and that'll be just to tell you some more uses of it especially with your food. Go pick yourself up some coconut oil. That's some good stuff. <laughs> I'll see you later and don't forget to subscribe.